everybody and welcome back to another video today we're going to be doing a little experiment we're going to be seeing how circular i can get this square piece of paper it's a six by six inch um square of commie and uh we're, we're going to begin by creating an octagon because that has eight sides and it it's just easier because it goes four to eight sixteen etc uh and to do this accurately um i'm going to need to divide this paper into thirds so I'm going to go ahead and do that. I've gone ahead and divided this paper into thirds. Uh, maybe tomorrow I'll do a tutorial on how to do this. But for now, uh, what I'm going to do is turn it over white side up because I want the, um, the, the nice side to be red. I'm just going to fold all of these inwards uh, to make an octagon. Okay, so I, fold all of, I folded all of these inwards to make the octagon, and here it is. It's already looking much more circular than it was uh, before. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to make creases here, 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 and here. And then I'm going to fold these along those creases. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Quality in that last clip kind of sucked, but it's whatever. Anyways, now I'm going to, um, now I'm going to fold, uh, make creases here, 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 and here. So I can fold, uh, so I can fold these along like that. So now that all of the creases are in place, uh, I'm going to start doing the folds. So I'm just going to fold in between these two creases, like so. And then just repeat that all the way around. So I finished folding everything in and um, there's still only eight sides, but it, it's already looking a lot more circular. So now there's already, um, I'm not sure if you can see if I'll zoom in a bit. Uh, there's creases here going there and there. So I'm just going to fold that down along those creases. Uh, you, you might be wondering, if I actually folded these down, then that would eliminate two sides, meaning I would just uh, be making it um, less circular. So I'm actually folding and unfolding it, and then I'm going to uh, take the point and fold it to the crease that I just made, and that will make it more circular. I think that uh, um, I'm actually done getting this as circular as it can be. Uh, that's due to the fact that I'm only using six inch paper. And if I were to try to do that again, as you can see, it's it's pretty much impossible. Uh, it doesn't look as circular as it actually is due to the fact that these creases are super emphasized. The, uh, the ones right there, which is unfortunate. But uh, in person, it, it's pretty circular. And if you turn it over, as you can see, it is as well. Now, maybe it, if this video gets, let's say, um, this is ridiculous because I don't want to do it. But let's say if this video gets 20 likes, I'll do this using a super big sheet of paper and see how uh, circular I can get a piece of paper. Uh, anyways, that's all I'm doing for today. Uh, I'm really tired from recording. And anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.